and today we're gonna compare the Elite Alpha Trooper CS6 or CS12 and the Alpha Trooper CS18 which is end strike. Uh, one major difference is the internals actually. The, this has a direct plunger just like a long shot while well, this has like the other end strike guns a reverse plunger. So the reason they have a reverse plunger is unknown because well nerf just downgraded it. Yeah, so second reason we second minor difference actually is that this came with a 18 round drum because it came with they both come with slam fire. So, so and this one also comes with a six clip. This is one pro for the Alpha Trooper CS18 because if you wanna go slam fire with a six clip you won't have enough well this do it all day. So, but problem with the there's this problem with the reverse plunger where first it makes it harder to push and it also makes it jam out. So, uh, my recommendations is you buy the new Alpha Trooper CS six or if you're lucky you can get a CS twelve. CS eighteen you're gonna have to buy one from eBay. So, yeah, that's it. So. Also, um, <coughs> the similarities. So the similarities is they both can, they both take magazines. See, and they, have, they both have uh, adapter for a stock, tactical rail up top, just like both, and same position of the jam door. And they both pump action slam fire. So the CS6, if you get a CS6 with a drum. Yeah, you can buy a drum mic separately, and it's much better for slam fire than this. See, it just jumped on me. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Now let's go to the firing range. Oh, hard. Don't go far. Don't go far. So, let me change this. Can you cut? Can you cut the video until I finish doing? Okay. You didn't see any of it. So, first we're gonna do the fire range of the standard. The party and strike one. This should be called standard, and this is the original. So, here's me on the fire. So we've got twelve shots on each. So we're gonna do six shots foot, and then six shots slam fire. Fire. Oh, yeah. So that's it. So if you don't mind, I'll be eating now. <laughs> 